There were some pretty cool inventions at this year's Senior Project Expo at Stevens Institute of Technology. We'll show you a few. Those stories and more on Cablevision's Hudson News Edition. Robotics and biomedical applications are just a few examples of the creativity on display at today's Senior Project Expo at Hoboken's Stevens Institute of Technology. As Jeff Hennig tells us, the engineering projects are part of the students' graduation requirement. Approximately 80 team projects, many featuring leading-edge interactive technologies, were on display in the Charles Schaefer Athletic Center today. Teams of graduating students demonstrated the projects they jointly engineered, many featuring mechanical and electronic devices, as well as virtual prototypes. This is a way for them to present to the community the work they've been doing over the whole of their senior years. So it's meant to be the culmination of all their um, technical presentation, their technical skills as they develop them through the curriculum. A gyroscopic device has been designed to give the elderly and people rehabilitating injuries a gentle form of exercise. We know we wanted to take advantage of uh, gyroscopic torques and the restorative moments that they provide in order to provide a form of low impact resistance. So we based our idea off that and. Uh, that's how we came up with the uh, rotating flywheel idea. We're just going to rev up the unit. So you have three different speeds, high, medium, and low. We'll demonstrate with high. And then you pick up the unit straight up like this. And then basically it's just a change in orientation. You rotate it. You can do a punching movement like this or any form that's just going to change it in reference to the vertical. And that's how you feel the torques and the resistance. The Win Robo is a robotic window washing machine designed for home use in those hard to reach places. It has vacuum cups that, that adhere to the window and it drags across the window to clean it. It's a proof of design concept that it was for an ASME competition and it, uh, it uses touch sensors to let us know where it is on the window and then it, it finishes and it turns on a light and it says that it's done. The concept of a robotic window washer was quite popular at today's expo because there wasn't just one, there was a second as well. The wiper goes back and forth and it has sensors to detect the edges of the window. Um, you see it's cleaning as it goes. And once it makes two passes, it'll move down the window to the next position. So it's kind of like a typewriter where it goes back and forth and moves down and goes and does the next spot. In general, the work is akin and equal to what we would normally see in an engineering or science trade show, a professional trade show where someone might be looking to market their product, their invention to a venture capitalist firm or a, or a company corporation. It's of that high quality. In previous years, venture capitalists have funded students to create a company and market their inventions. At Stevens Institute of Technology, Jeff Hennig, Neighborhood Journal.